In today's video, after every touchdown scored, I will upgrade T. Higgins' card in Madden 23, starting off with his core elite 82 overall, all the way up to his 99 overall golden ticket. There are a couple different versions. One is the 82 overall core elite card, which is really bad, only has like 82 speed. The next card is going to be his most feared 87 overall, followed by his 92 overall theme team remix, then his 95 overall gridiron guardians card, and his last card is going to be the golden ticket if you guys are new to the channel make sure to like and subscribe and let's go ahead and get on with the video starting off with the 82 overall core elite t higgins all right guys this is going to be crazy we have t higgins on the side he is of course an 82 overall i'm actually not too sure how i expect to honestly get him open but if he can get open that'll be crazy this we might actually have T. Higgins, and he, he actually got the ball. I actually can't believe he actually caught that 29-yard ball. Okay, so that's a good sign. Wow, T. Higgins, I actually can't believe he somehow managed to do that. All right, guys, I'm running with a touch pass. This touch pass should get T. Higgins potentially in the end zone. I'm hoping he gets in there. T. Higgins, fight, buddy! And he doesn't get in there. Oh, that's so unfortunate. All right, I guess we got to try it one more time. All right, I'm not going to lie. My only kind of hope here is that T. Higgins can get open on a zig route. Which, why in the world is this guy doubling him? Come on, Higgins. Oh, my God, Higgins. Just get into the end zone, buddy. Higgins. Higgins catches the touchdown. Finally, we end up getting Higgins the touchdown. Oh, it feels so great. We got the fumble. Let's go. Come on. All right. As you guys can see, we do have T. Higgins on the field. I did give him short and elite. This is his 87 overall card. All right. Let's go ahead and see what we can get with this T. Higgins. Rocking that short and elite. He should be able to get open. And oh my, he actually got wide open. Perfectly gone past 27 yard gain for T. Higgins. That's an interception. Brent, he actually ended up picking up the ball the first time off the fumble. So let's go ahead and get back on offense with T. Higgins. I will say I am kind of expecting a lot from a from an 87 overall. So I guess there's that going for it. But we do got T. Higgins. We just got to play smart. All right, T. Higgins is going to get open. Perfectly thrown ball right into the middle. It would help if I had something like red zone threat. That would really help T. Higgins actually get in there. But, you know, six foot four. Only one way to try this out, and doesn't work out again. Another interception. This is going to be Chad Johnson. And, all right, this should be a time for maybe T. Higgins to get open. We actually do have T. Higgins in the back of the end zone, finally. Starting on defense, this guy throws me an easy interception. Ward is going to take that to the house. Now, this is the brand new rookie premier Ward, so he's actually really good. 99 everything, but we're going to take that touchdown. I just wanted to get really a lot more gameplay with Higgins. Starting off on offense now, I'm just honestly looking for Higgins. Maybe we might find him, and we do find him on a corner route. And of course, he's getting a bunch of yards. Unfortunately, we could not get into the end zone there. So on the very next play, I'm throwing a little corner route. And of course, one-on-one -on -one coverage, I thought I could get it. He is 6'4". Maybe he'd get something. Then I go to a touch pass, and the touch pass, honestly, I thought was going to work. But he kind of just started running very slow, so that was very unfortunate. Now for a hot route, and I ended up putting him on another one of these post routes. One-on-one -on -one coverage, he's just honestly kind of getting bagged at the moment, but we're going to try this one more time, and honestly, he just doesn't get any type of separation there, so it didn't really work out, but we're back on offense for another possession, and this one, honestly, I just decided to throw a streak and see how it actually go, and of course, six foot four, high ball, of course it's going to work. Now, time to go ahead and get this touchdown with them. And honestly, we're going to do the same thing. We're just going to put him on a streak and basically throw it right at his user. And there it is, a touchdown with T. Higgins. All right, so as you can see, we have T. Higgins lined up in the slot. He has short out, deep in, and short in elite. This honestly shouldn't be too hard of a touchdown. But honestly, I'm going to chuck it right at him and see if he could actually get it. And it looks like he's kind of come down with it. Touchdown, T. Higgins. That was actually a really good T. Higgins, too. He had 96 speed and, like, 99 short route running, so a ridiculous card. All right, so this guy doesn't have anybody up top. I honestly think we could actually get T. What? Higgins. Oh, he was in there. All right, I think I'm going to put maybe Chad Johnson, or honestly, just chuck this. Why not? Touchdown. Wow. 
Look at that touchdown by T. Higgins. Honestly, he is literally unstoppable. All right, to be fair, I'm a little confused why this guy is still in this game, but you know what? If he wants to stay, I'm down because T. Higgins is going to get another touchdown. Oh my god, it feels so great to use a good T. Higgins right now. This 95 overall T. Higgins is absolutely insane. All right, he's in five wide, which honestly makes me kind of... Actually, I thought he was going to run. I guess not. But we will take the interception with Peppers. And I guess we're going to get maybe down to the 24-yard line. Perfect. All right, so as you can see, we do have T. Higgins on the field. He has route tech, deep out elite, short in, and short out elite. Let's go ahead and see if we could actually get him open. It does look like he is going to break off, and that is going to be a touchdown with T. Higgins. T. Higgins does not get his feet. Actually, he does get his feet down. That was very surprising. If we can get this open, that would be crazy. That is an overthrow and a half, but he almost had it. All right, so I've just realized this guy has that Simmons, which is kind of lighting up, but it's also not the good one unless he has a 99 strat card, but I guess we'll find out. And T. Higgins actually had a really good run, 30 yards. All right, this is a very interesting play, and I just want to see if this route even works. It actually almost did work. All right, let's try this very weird play and see if Higgins can do anything. And definitely not. Okay. All right, so T. Higgins does have short out elite and deep out, so I'm kind of hoping we can maybe get him open and we might actually times like this is kind of where red zone threat would honestly come in clutch because sometimes deep out just isn't really the best thing in the world but we do have one-on-one -on -one situation and that is a touchdown for t higgins bonus content right there i never run man coverage and of course when he want when i want to run man he wants to run i was hoping he was actually gonna pass i knew that fumble was coming eventually <laughs> all right so we have t higgins on the outside Hopefully he could just honestly get open because I'm going to chuck it at him anyways. And we should have this. Oh, he's got a deep out KO on them. It's unfortunate. Well, even with a deep out KO, we should still somehow get him open. Oh, can he get that? Oh, wow. I can't believe I actually threaded the needle with T Higgins right there. Why? Are, I was going to say, why is this guy pressing cup? I don't, it's kind of pointless. Double me? Oh my god. Oh my. Nah, this is this is different. If I can get him to the outside, it's going to be really bad for him. I think we might have a one-on-one -on -one oh touchdown. In between like four defenders, maybe even five, another touchdown. Well, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. I had a lot of fun trying out every single version of T. Higgins and upgrading after every single touchdown. I even managed to win a majority of the games that I did play. And that says a lot because a lot of these cards were really bad, but I had some really good ones. But make sure to like, subscribe, put on post notifications so you guys don't miss another video. Have a great rest of your day. I'm out. Peace.